Well, hello there. Today we're going to watch a classic TV series called The Waltons, a show that I'm sure most of our listeners are familiar with. The Waltons is known far and wide as one of the best TV series to ever hit the air. So today we're going to reminisce and watch the series again with the entire cast of Then and Now. We will tell you about the original names and ages of the actors from the show and how they changed in 2023. Okay, let's check it out together. Richard Thomas was born on June 13, 1951 in Manhattan, New York. He played the character John Boy Walton in the series when he was 21 years old in 1972. Currently, he's living happily at the age of 72. Get in the house, Mary Ellen. Don't fight him, John Boy. Don't let my being bigger than you stop you, pit. Uh, exactly. It's like five months to go, and it's basically a year and a half to her. So we've been doing it all. We've done, I think, this week we will. Ralph Waite was born on June 22, 1928, in White Plains, New York. He played the character John Walton Sr. in the series when he was 44 years old in 1972. Sadly, on February 13, 2014, Wade died of age-related illnesses in Palm Desert, California at the age of 85. No one man can tell another man how to live. In the long run, I guess, every man has to do what he has to do. People have a deep appreciation for, the, for, for, for that series for some reason. It struck a nerve. I don't take seriously being uh, a hero. Michael Learned was born on April 9th, 1939 in Washington, D.C. She played the character Olivia Walton in the series when she was 33 years old in 1972. Currently, she's living happily at the age of 84. Nine dollars. Can I bring that? Sure. I'm sorry, honey. I went from uh, the American Conservatory Theater in San Francisco um, to suddenly becoming a, a household name, really. Ellen Corby was born on June 3rd, 1911, in Racine, Wisconsin. She played the character Esther Walton in the series when she was 61 years old in 1972. Sadly, on April 14th, 1999, Corby died of natural causes at the Motion Picture and Television Country House and Hospital in Woodland Hills, Los Angeles, at the age of 87. Have I interrupted something? Oh, eight years. Apparently I have. You have to enjoy it, because I'm not sure if it's how many times around, but it might be just one. Boy, you better. Will Gear was born on March 9, 1902 in Frankfurt, Indiana. He played the character The Grandfather in the series when he was 70 years old in 1972. Sadly, on April 22, 1978, Gear died of respiratory failure in his home in Los Angeles, California at the age of 76. <laughs> what are you laughing at? Oh, I was just thinking, Esther. We are going to be rich. The end. Line of the eye, the quicker they come. <laughs> <laughs> but no kidding, we're going to appeal to the heartstrings of the people who remember when John L. Lewis used to art. Judy Norton was born on January 29, 1958, in Santa Monica, California. She played the character Mary Ellen Walton in the series when she was 14 years old in 1972. Currently, she's living happily at the age of 65. I suppose you call that a proposal? It's the best one you're gonna get from me. Well, I wouldn't marry you, Curtis Willard, if you were the last man on earth. Welcome back to another segment of Behind the Scenes of the Waltons. Today, I have another special guest. It is my pleasure to welcome Charlotte Stewart. John Walmsley was born on February 6, 1956 in Blackburn, UK. He played the character Jason Walton in the series when he was 16 years old in 1972. Currently, he's living happily at the age of 67. I enjoyed it. Um, there really wasn't uh, much of a downside at that point, you know. 
Mary Elizabeth McDonough was born on May 4, 1961 in Los Angeles, California. She played the character Erin Walton in the series when she was 11 years old in 1972. Currently, she's living happily at the age of 62. Well, it's the truth. What am I anyway? Mary Ellen's the oldest girl, and Elizabeth's a baby. Mary Ellen's loud and funny. She makes people mad, and she also makes them laugh. You guys haven't changed a bit. You all look the <laughs> exact same as you did back in the day. It's unbelievable. Really? I don't know. My... I mean, really. Eric Scott was born on October 20th, 1958 in Los Angeles, California. He played the character Ben Walton in the series when he was 14 years old in 1972. Currently, he's living happily at the age of 64. Jim Bob's here. Well, I saw you looking at Ruby. Let's forget about him, okay? Yeah, so when we were when we were casting for the Homecoming, which is the pilot movie for the for the series, there was two characters, two younger boys. Uh, one was Ben. And David W. Harper was born on October fourth, nineteen sixty one, in Abilene, Texas. He played the character Jim Bob Walton in the series when he was eleven years old in nineteen seventy two. Currently, he's living happily at the age of sixty one. Good luck, son. With total ab objectivity, kind of like, you know, uh, you know, anybody. And uh, I still have a little trouble. Peggy Ree was born on March 31st, 1921 in Los Angeles, California. She played the character Rose Burton in the series when she was 57 years old in 1978. Sadly, on February 5th, 2011, Re died from complications of heart failure in Toluca Lake, California, at the age of 89. It was the night he started beating Jeffrey with a belt over and over again that I knew I had to get those children out of there. Joe Conley was born on March 3, 1928, in Buffalo, New York. He played the character Ike Godsey in the series when he was 44 years old in 1972. Sadly, on July 7, 2013, Conley died of complications from dementia at a care facility in Newberry Park, California, at the age of 85. You know, he certainly is a nice sort of boy. Uh, he talks a little funny. Got a foreign accent, I think. Yeah, you know, it's English. English? Day of the week. Uh, when it came time for me to go on the Walton interview, it, it hadn't been named. All we knew was that. Uh, Ronnie Claire Edwards was born on February 9, 1933 in Oklahoma City, Oklahoma. She played the character Cora Beth Godsey in the series when she was 42 years old in 1975. Sadly, on June 14, 2016, Edwards died of chronic obstructive pulmonary disease in Dallas, Texas at the age of 83. Both, as a, a couple were given very well-written parts. Leslie Winston was born on May 13, 1956, in Austin, Texas. She played the character Cindy Brunson Walton in the series when she was 23 years old in 1979. Currently, she's living happily at the age of 67. Yes, well, I'm here because I would love to, to meet my fans, yeah. and so I'm, I'm here for that reason. I... Mary Jackson was born on November 22, 1910 in Milford, Michigan. She played the character Emily Baldwin in the series when she was 62 years old in 1972. Sadly, on December 10, 2005, Jackson died from Parkinson's disease in Los Angeles, California at the age of 95. Cousin Elvira was peculiar, too. Remember, they used to have all those bats in the house, and they used to run up and down the upstairs. Helen Klebe was born on January 6, 1907, in South Bend, Washington. She played the character Mamie Baldwin in the series when she was 65 years old in 1972. On December 28, 2003, Klebe died of natural causes in Los Angeles, California, 
at the age of 96. Disturb you. Disturb us? Oh, no, Jason. It's pure pleasure for sister and me to hear you draw music from that old piano. Cammie Kotler was born on June 17, 1965 in Long Beach, California. She played the character Elizabeth Walton in the series when she was seven years old in 1972. Currently, she's living happily at the age of 57. Now, why would God be mad at you? I told you, Senator. did that not that long ago, and then I think he's heading out here for um, for the wedding, so we're, we're going to get together again uh, next weekend, weekend after, so. We miss the Waltons TV series cast so much. Thanks for watching, guys. Please like and share the video and subscribe to our channel. Thank you. See you on the next video.